We had three water tanks on our caravan and to fill them, it was an absolute nightmare. There's two fillers on the back. The rear one has got the water tank about here on the van and the second one, the water tank's there. The rear filler wasn't too bad, that'll run water straight into the tank. But the one on the front, it almost lose 50% of the water when you run it in there to try and fill it. The third tank, although Ford on the van and the fillers Ford, the filler hose itself actually went all the way through Ford in up over the top of the drawbar and then back to the tank which is mounted about here. And that one probably for every 100 litres you'd try and put in there, 99 of them would go on the ground. It was just almost impossible to fill. So to overcome all the dramas we had with the filling, we made a bottom fill system and I'll run through with what we've done. To mount the manifold to do that, we actually had a toolbox here, aluminium toolbox mounted, made up and mounted on the bottom of the chassis and everything to do with filling is inside there. That one there is the main inlet for water coming from any town's pressure or caravan park, feeds water into the van and from there, is this line, which is a little bit hard to see, this line here, that comes from the water supply of the van through a tap here so we can regulate the speed that we feed water into our manifold which is mounted inside that uh, toolbox there. Now looking inside the toolbox, there's a manifold. What we've got, we've got the rear tank there. You see the blue hose going down the bottom. That goes to the bottom of the tank. That one there, that's the centre tank, and in behind the fitting there, another blue hose that goes into the bottom of that tank, and that's the front tank there with the blue hose going to the bottom of it. Manifold set there, that's the inlet from the tap on the side that I showed just previously, and on off tap there, so now we've got water being fed through to that manifold, and it's only a matter of turning each individual tank on to feed it into the bottom, and fill the tank from the bottom without losing any water at all. At any time while there's mains water pressure hooked up to that inlet of the water on coming into the van, it's only a matter of turning that tap on that I showed earlier and filling the tanks. There's no need to take the breather caps or filler caps off of the inlet to the main standard factory fill area. It will breathe through the breather behind that cap. One of Barney's that we have got is filling it this way. We can, when we're home getting ready to go away, have the water slowly going in to fill the tanks while we're doing other preparation work. If you like the video that you just watched, give us a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of our videos, hit the subscribe button. And once you've done that, tap on the bell and change the notification to all. That way every time we do uploads to our YouTube channel, you'll be notified.